Jazzy, congratulations booking a quarter final spot here at the Ball Sports Grand Slam of Darts. I'm guessing that was a little bit more routine than what you're expecting. Yeah, I mean, 5 0 up at the first break, I felt pretty comfortable, and then, you know, you, you just think it's, it's just going to fall in place, but it doesn't happen like that all the time, and I'm just glad I play well. I always beat myself up after a break and end up losing a leg or two, and that's what happened. I come out, lost the first leg, and then won another five on the bounce, but you know, just something I need to conquer in my own head. and. I play well. I, I I didn't score as well as I could, but those one dart finishes, yeah, they 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 give me that ten moment. A top level sport that you guys are playing out there, five nils almost irreplaceable, isn't it? You can't. It's hard to come back. I don't know. Didn't you watch the game against Nathan? <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, it is. Like for for me to be five nil up, happy days. I'm over the moon, but like I said, it's it's never over until that final dart goes in, and I'm glad I stuck it out till the end. And. Like Darren said to me after the match, yeah, you were ruthless here and yeah, I'm happy with that, com that compliment, I think, because sometimes you, you, can, you can be so far in front and be a bit too complacent and just, just let things slip away and yeah, to win 10-1, I'm glad I go over the line and finished not in style, but the, the way I wanted to. Now you've spoken about these new shirts quite a lot, now it's a great result in it, we can see you're smiling. Have you always been superstitious about things like this? <laughs> not until I play darts, but... I don't know, you just try to get everything perfect, ready for when you're going to play and it's not always throwing darts at the perfect, it's the way you get your mind perfect and if you're thinking right then anything's possible and <laughs> sometimes when I wear a different shirt and I lose then my mind ain't right so I just go back to what I, what I know best. Can you massively overthink this game then, away from just throwing darts? Yeah, not just me but everybody is. Like I said, this, everybody can throw darts, we're going to 10, 11, 12 darters for fun, 9 darters you and they and it's just the top two inches that count. The, the more you overthink this game, the worse it is. And I think that's probably why Michael and you know, the other people like Chizzy and, and um, Anderson, that, that's why they're so good. They've been in the game that long. They're, they're more experienced and they know how to deal with certain uh, situations. And yeah, I'm getting it. We heard you're going home now to spend some time at home. Do you need massive family time in between these big games in big tournaments like this? No, I just all, all my clothes are dirty. So I'm going to go home, <laughs> the wife's going to clean them. Uh, um, yeah, just, it's just one night at home in your own bed, I think it'll help me and give me a recharge of the batteries. Maybe the wife and the kids will come back up. I'm, I'm not sure yet. See what see what happens. Quarter final against Gary Adams or Rob, Robert Thornton. Are you gonna stick around to see who you play in that game? No. As soon as this is done, I'm getting in the car. We're gonna head home. Probably not gonna get home till 12, 1 in the morning, and then straight to bed. Chill out tomorrow and get back here maybe tomorrow night or early Saturday morning. Gazi, pleasure as always. Thanks, Jeremy. No worries. Cheers, man. Okay, just a couple for me, if that's all right. How different has the journey in this year's tournament been so far compared to last year? Um. I don't know, pretty much the same, I think. Um, I topped the group last year and then, you know, it, it was a different route for me, obviously different players last year, but yeah, I'm happy. I'm, I'm playing a lot better, I'm in a better place and my my mind's a lot better this year, believe it or not, but yeah, I'm I'm, I'm a little bit more confident. And 10-1 compared to some of the other games, it's been a fairly easy turnover. Is that play into your hands in the quarterfinals? Um, I don't know, no, I don't think so, because you've got a full 24 hours off or maybe a bit longer, so that doesn't really matter. You know, if the, like, the first game went 10-9, I don't think that matters to them. They've got, like I said, 24 hours off all day tomorrow, back Saturday night, so yeah, it doesn't really matter. Okay. Thank you very much, Jim. No worries.